When the game begins, you must produce new villagers to rapidly grow your settlement. To support them, first focus on putting your existing villagers to work, gathering food from nearby sheep. While your villagers are working, use your scout to explore the surrounding area and locate additional resources. When you find more sheep, use your scout to herd them back to your town so that your villagers always have food to gather. Once your scout finds a herd of deer, order your villagers to hunt them. A growing town needs more buildings to support its residents. Construct additional houses to increase your population capacity. Place economic buildings near resources so that your villagers gather more efficiently and waste less time walking. You can also improve your villagers' gathering rates by researching new technologies at your economic buildings. Survival techniques, for example, allows your villagers to hunt faster and carry more food. When you have enough villagers, advance to the next age by constructing a landmark. Each landmark provides a different set of benefits, so choose wisely. When your landmark is complete, your village will spring into the next age, ready to keep growing. To complete this challenge, you must produce many villages and gather enough food and gold to place a landmark and advance to the feudal age. Good luck. Your villagers need houses. Build a house each time that you have two or less remaining population capacity. Hunting exposes your villagers to raids. But deer are a faster source of food than farms, berry bushes, or sheep. Well done. Your mill is complete. Consider researching survival techniques to make your hunters more effective. Yeah. 
Vidra, yeah, yeah. Pets after the end, eh? Wait, huh? Here's this. You have enough resources to construct a landmark, but you also need more villagers to finish this challenge. Well done. You have quickly built up your economy and are ready for the next age. <laughs> 